Today, retailers, including supermarkets, are facing significant changes in their industry. There are diverse factors behind this, including the rapid growth of e-commerce, changes in consumer behavior, and the increasing complexity of supply chains. Additionally, achieving decarbonization as promoted by sustainable development goals is also important for companies. For retailers to survive with limited finances and resources, they must revise their management strategies with innovations, such as improving efficiency and reducing cost by using diverse data obtained through the progress of digitalization. Hitachi extensively offers the latest digital solutions utilizing Lumata to solve customers' various issues. Today, we introduce a co-creation case with Kasumi, a company striving to create a new supermarket business model. Kasumi is a part of United Supermarkets Holdings, which runs the largest scale supermarket business in the greater Tokyo area, with about 190 community-based stores. They are taking a variety of initiatives to adapt to social changes, decreasing birth rate, aging population, and overall population decline. Currently, physical stores are at a turning point and we're working to develop new stores. We want to create stores where customers can enjoy shopping in a comfortable space and where the stores can become central to the local community. In the supermarket business, it's necessary to look to the future and efficiently manage finance and facilities for store operations. Air conditioning and refrigeration. These aging facilities and eco-friendly energy-saving measures require large-scale investment. So there must be a return on that investment. I think a large hurdle to overcome was that we had to proceed while minimizing the effects on profit and loss of the store. We were also searching for a way to systemize management of facilities and over 200 assets to pursue efficiency. Hitachi faced the business challenge together with Kasumi, searching for a solution, and suggested an energy and facility management as a service, EFAS, that unifies energy operations and facility management with digital technologies through utilization of Lumata. We thought that Kasumi would be able to concentrate on their core business if Hitachi takes over management and operations of the facilities. So we suggested energy and facility management as a service. For energy management, power usage data was collected every 30 minutes for the incoming power, air conditioning, and refrigeration systems, and data was visualized and stored on the cloud. This allows the required information to be shared anywhere, anytime via the platform. Comparison and analysis of data from multiple stores will make it possible to identify the trends of the status of facility operations, visualize issues to be improved, predict signs of facility failure, leading to optimal control and operations. As to the facility management, Management efficiency and optimal facility renewal plans can be reached through unified management of real estate contracts, design drawing data, and ledgers for air conditioning and other facilities via the cloud utilizing digital technologies. First, this collaboration started with air conditioning, and the first store for IFAS implementation was the Namiki store. The predicted electricity consumption reduction was 13.2%, and our results were nearly the same. Results are on a monthly basis, so we won't know an accurate number until we look over the long term. But at least there was no financial burden, and the balance between facility fees and energy saving effects was as planned. I think it was great that we implemented EFAS with a store where we couldn't secure large-scale investments, as we could renew facilities without having to hold assets. 
The next step that we can conceive are initiatives for operations, including maintenance. I hope we can increase efficiency for this as well and strengthen our mutual win-win relationship. By combining our finances, Hitachi updated air conditioning through IFAS and introduced EMS at five stores. I think reducing their electricity bill by updating to highly efficient units and providing a multi-site energy monitoring environment using EMS were our first step towards offering a comfortable environment. Hitachi is currently gathering data by utilizing its facility management platform that aims to improve operational efficiency and management quality, as well as its energy management platform that unifies management from multiple locations. There are two key points to progress the EFAS platform, and one of these is target field expansion. We can expand the merits of scaling by visualizing refrigeration and freezer facilities and lighting all the way to unified store management, contributing to increased efficiency. The other is advancing data analysis and utilization. Energy-related data will quickly be accumulated as the implementation of the platform increase, leading to a shift from TBM to CBM and an optimization of store energy balance. As for future initiatives, we are already asking Hitachi to expand EMS and IFAS. EMS began with air conditioning, and we want to comprehensively manage EMS for refrigeration, lighting, and other things that need electricity, and advance EMS, which has been industry-specific, and continue the relationship with Hitachi through these initiatives. Hitachi will increase customers' social values, environmental values, and economic values through innovation that utilizes digital technology, contributing to an improvement in quality of life.